or have a great opportunity coming up where we'll get to travel to Canada. Uh, we're flying up to Seattle October 11th, and then we uh, from there we'll drive up to Vancouver. At first, we actually get to practice at University of Washington. We've uh, set that up with their coaches so we can get there, get a light practice in, continue the trip on up to Vancouver. Uh, from there, we'll uh, do some sightseeing, and then we play three games in three days on uh, beginning on the 14th, uh, starting off with Douglas College, going to Capilano, and then Camasun. Uh, so three games in three days, so it'll be a you know pretty big uh, feat for us, but we're excited about the opportunity, and obviously just a great learning opportunity for the girls to travel and see a part of the country that they most of them might not get to see again. Well, the NCAA rules allow us uh, 10 practices within a 20-day window, so we've taken advantage of that, and we're uh, currently starting our ninth, ninth day of practice today, uh, beginning this afternoon. We're excited about it. It just gives us a great opportunity to bond together prior to the season, Obviously, the game experience is great, but I'm just really excited about the opportunity for the girls to bond with each other, and the time spent is going to be very valuable for us. Uh, I'm excited about this group, excited about the chemistry that we have been able to develop in such a short time. Well, the newcomers that are coming in, we're, obviously, we had a chance to evaluate them and see them several times throughout the past year, and so we're basically taking those evaluations and, and going from there and, and, and putting a team together based on that. And uh, with that, we kind of know where they fall into place. We know what they provide, what they bring to the program. And this gives them an opportunity to prove what they can do, uh, how they can help bolster the program and the lineup early on in the season with these three games coming up. When we'll get to go around, we'll go to Stanley Park, which is close by. We're staying in downtown Vancouver. Uh, it's a great hotel, just a great uh, location where we're close to lots of, you know, a lot of the sights and sounds of the city. Uh, Vancouver is a great, very you know, uh, pedestrian-friendly city, so it allows us to walk around and uh, see some of the great, you know, the great skyline, the water. Stanley Park is phenomenal. I went there two years ago, and uh, it, it's just great. What's exciting about it is to see. Obviously, I've had an opportunity to experience this this place in, in Vancouver, but to see the faces on the girls and, and the excitement in their eyes when they see something for the first time is just it's going to be an awesome experience for me knowing how much they're going to enjoy this trip right we'll come back on uh, october 18th which is a saturday so we'll travel in basically uh, that whole day will be devoted to traveling we'll have off sunday then we'll get back in uh, in the gym on october 20th and, and start our regular 19 week uh, season so we're looking forward to that as well it's just uh, this is one big step and one big opportunity for us to help propel us to you know good things as the year goes on